Chapter 49 All the Jewish Parties There were three main parties of Jews, and a fourth intrusive one. The three respective parties were Sadducees, Pharisees, and the Essenes. The Sadducees were priestly aristocrats, the Pharisees were teachers of point of law to the people, and the Essenes were isolated and mystical with many Greek ideas, such as valuing celibacy and community of property. The fourth philosophy was the militant nationalists, their nucleus called zealots appeared in the first century AD, when Judea became a country occupied by Romans. They were diaspora Essenes, the seekers after smooth things who were attacked by their Palestinian counterparts in some of the Dead Sea Scrolls. They staged constant exciting demonstrations, calling on God to help them shake off the hated Romans, and they were who eventually brought about the destruction of Jerusalem. Their remnants committed mass suicide on Masada in 74 AD. Through its close detail of persons and organization, the concealed history in the New Testament traces the way that these four parties developed into the Jewish religion that remains, and into Christians. The main cause of the groupings and regroupings was the influence of Greco-Roman culture, but the success of Herod supplied the personal factor. In 21 BC, Herod the Great had rejected the ascetics plan for a new temple, two permanent divisions opened up, both of which contained members of the four parties. From this time on, there were anti-Herodian Pharisees, Sadducees, Essenes, and Zealots, and pro-Herodians Pharisees, Sadducees, Essenes, and Zealots. The former survived as the Eastern Party containing the element that became present-day Judaism, the latter at first became, an alliance of Herodians and Christians in the West, and after the Herod dynasty died out, there were only Christians. The Eastern anti-Herod side had its extremists and more moderate wings. The extremists were the Damascus proselytizers for Judaism, the true zealots, their chief monk, Simon Magus was called the second death. Their moderates were the Pharisees, such as Caiaphas the high priest, whose teaching survived the fall of Jerusalem and continued as Orthodox Judaism. At first, linked with them were the honest priests and their followers, who in 6 AD had thought they were free of the Herods. This was the outlook of Sadducees such as Jonathan Annas, and the higher orders of Palestinian Essenes, as well as Gentiles such as James Nysta. They were opposed to the extravagant claims of Agrippa, and probably assisted in his assassination in 44 AD. For some years they remained independent of the West and occupied Qumran as their celibate center, their leaders being Jonathan Annas, Apollos, John Mark, and James the stepbrother of Jesus. In 50 AD, as Revelations shows, some of them went over to the West persuaded by the sensible behavior of Agrippa II. This party became Jewish Christians. Of the Western groupings who remained loyal to the Agrippas, the nucleus, supporting Agrippa II, were Sadducees led by Matthew Annas and Theophilus Annas, the two Annas brothers who were most cooperative with Rome. Both benefited from the benign reign of the Emperor Claudius to become a party whose emblem was the Dove of Peace. Led by Peter, with them were the village Essenes. In 43 AD, in Antioch, this party first began to use the name, Christian. Their Gentile members lived like Peter, married men who followed the discipline of pilgrims. Led by John Aquila, these Gentiles were called the Church. Close to them was ascetic Pharisees, the successors of Hillel the Great, who supported the Agrippas. From 40 AD, their leader was Paul. His conversion had been a change of mind on issues affecting the group that became Jewish Christians, which in the Gospel period included Jesus. But he was part of the court of the Herods and particularly close to Timothy Herod, whom the childless Agrippa II had appointed as his heir. Paul's party did not use the name Christian and did not give the primary leadership to honest priest. Instead, the Herod was Pontifex Maximus slash Agrippa II, and his house in Rome was the center of the movement. Paul's party called themselves Romans. Late in the reign of Claudius, and under the Emperor Nero, led by Bernice the sister of Agrippa, the Herod family developed their form of zealotry. Their involvement in the fall of Jerusalem has been described in chapter 11 and is the main theme of part C of Revelation. Tychicus, the third seer, one of Paul's party moved towards their outlook together with Ananus the Younger, the last of the Annas brothers. Their version of Herodianism died out with the fall of Masada, where all zealots gathered on a property belonging to the ruling Herods. In broad terms, the party history may be summarized. Pro-Herod West Herodian Sagrippa II, to 100, and 2 AD. Christians Matthew. Peter Romans Paul. Jewish Christians John Mark, James Herodian Zealots, to 74 AD, Bernice. Anti-Herod East. Damascus Zealots, to 74 AD. Pharisees, continuing. These are the formations that were behind the different parts of Revelation. In the Gospel period, the emphasis was different. Agrippa I was just beginning his attempt to restore the Herodian monarchy and the issues were played out in terms of his rise. All parties were substantially Eastern. Then they were better summarized as Hebrews and Hellenists, the terms used in Acts. Those supporting Agrippa I were Hebrew, and they included John the Baptist and ascetic Pharisees under Gamaliel the predecessor of Paul. At this point, they included Caiaphas of the moderate Pharisees, and also the high-ranking celibate Essene with John the Baptist. 
Those against him were Hellenists, the Zealots under Simon Magus, and the moderate Sadducees under Jonathan Annas. With them was Jesus, during both the years of his public ministry 29-33 AD, and in the early years of his seclusion after the crucifixion. Early in that period, he was closely associated with John Mark and accepted by Hellenists as the legitimate David. He endorsed the doctrine of lay priesthood held by Simon Magus but supported the peace policy of Jonathan Annas. Pro Agrippa Hebrews. High Essenes John the Baptist, James. Caiaphas, Moderate Pharisees, Ascetic Pharisees, Gamaliel. Anti Agrippa Hellenists. Zealots. Jonathan Annas, Moderate Sadducees. Peter and Village Essenes. Jesus with John Mark, and Gentiles. In 44 AD, Agrippa I desired to be a god, and an eastern Caesar if not a western, it lost him support and only Gamaliel Pharisees supported him. That year, the realignment had taken place from which the Christians were formed. Caiaphas and the High Essenes traveled to Damascus, and the High Essenes came back to Qumran as Jewish Christians. In the meantime, Peter, the village Essenes, Matthew, and the pilgrim Gentiles with Jesus had changed their minds to support Agrippa II. Jesus separated from his former Hellenist associates and allied closely with Paul, who had changed his mind about his legitimacy and accepted him as the true David, and as the focus for Gentiles, with Agrippa being the leader for westernized Jews. Then the party history began the reflections that are in Revelation parts B, C, and D.